Since the earliest days on my channel, Midwinter Minis has had a really strong focus on the Warhammer Quest game Blackstone Fortress. After putting out my first few videos, mostly about sandstone necrons, in the fifth Midwinter Minis episode I kicked off my speed painting Blackstone Fortress series with the aim of showing newcomers to the hobby that painting miniatures doesn't have to be scary or take ages, and that you can get great game ready results in just a few minutes per model with a very limited paint selection. Since starting the series, and over the course of more than two years, I've put out 31 tutorial videos showing you how to paint every model from the main game and all of the game's boxed expansions. For a lot of people, Blackstone Fortress kind of became synonymous with Midwinter Minis, and I became a sort of unofficial ambassador for the game. Now though, the set is complete. There's new adventures to explore, new games to experience, and new models to collect, paint, and play with. With that in mind, I'm going to be giving away my entire Blackstone Fortress collection to someone watching this video right now. Maybe you. Now, I love raising money for charity whenever I can, and I don't really like the idea of the set just going to the highest bidder on eBay. So in association with the Nova Open Charitable Foundation, we're setting up a charity raffle, giving anyone who's interested the chance to get hold of my whole collection. At the moment, combined, all the videos in the speed painting Blackstone Fortress series have received almost 2 million views. So while it's definitely not the best painted set, quite bizarrely, it's probably the most famous Blackstone Fortress set out there, after Games Workshop Studio version, obviously. On eBay, fully painted sets of Blackstone Fortress often sell for more than £1,000, so it's a great chance to get an iconic Games Workshop board game, and a bit of Midwinter Minis history in one go, for a tiny fraction of the price. And even if you don't win, you'll have helped support a few very worthy charities. The charity raffle is going to be handled by the NOCF. They're the experts when it comes to this, and each ticket for the raffle will cost just nine US dollars. Speaking of charities, the foundations that the Nova Open support are Médecins Sans Frontières, Doctors Without Borders, who provide healthcare to the most vulnerable people in the world, in conflict zones, in the aftermath of natural disasters, and in community epidemics and outbreaks. Fisher House, a US-based charity who build comfort homes for the families of wounded veterans, where they can stay free of charge while a loved one is in hospital. The Breast Cancer Research Foundation, who provide critical funding for cancer research worldwide, fueling advances in tumor biology, genetics, prevention, treatment, and survivorship. And I asked if this Blackstone Fortress raffle could benefit a charity close to my heart, Calm, the campaign against living miserably. Depending on the country you live in, between 60 and 90% of all suicides will be male. And as difficult as it is, that's a topic that needs to be discussed. And that's what Calm does. They specialize in offering support to men in their darkest hour, from crisis support to spreading mental health awareness in the community. And I'm very proud to do what I can to support them. So that's the serious business taken care of. Now let's see what you have a chance to win if you enter the raffle. First up, obviously, my Blackstone Fortress box game, including all nine explorers and all 35 hostiles. The Escalation expansion, featuring five additional explorers and the unique Chaos Cultist squad. The dreaded Amble expansion, with the Amble itself and both of its little gribbly babies. Traitor Command, featuring the Chaos Commissar and his Ogren buddy. No Respite, with three Plague Marines and a cohort of Poxwalkers. Deadly Alliance, featuring the Zote Archivist model. And the final expansion, Ascension, featuring the giant Guardian drones. I'll throw in my sealed Abominable Intellect card set, pretty rare these days. And also the set of 3D printed Dragon's Rest pieces for the base game that I painted in a video. The whole thing will come with the awesome Felder storage system, specially designed to fit all the models and game aids without them smashing off each other and getting damaged. Huge thanks to the team at Felder for sending me this and supporting the charity raffle. If you want to check out their range of game storage solutions, there's a link and a discount code in the video description. I'll also throw in some little Midwinter Minis goodies for the winner too. So who are the people organizing this? The Nova Open Charitable Foundation is a US-based non-profit, and they've been fundraising with the tabletop wargaming and hobby community since 2013, and they do an awesome job of showing the world how compassionate and generous this community is. To date, through online raffles and events at the Nova Open, they have raised almost half a million dollars for worthy causes. They are well-versed in organizing charity raffles, so they fully comply with all the legal requirements. They're also a non-profit, so the only percentage they take from ticket sales are what they actually need to survive, pay their fees, shipping prizes, and organizing great giveaways and charitable events. Tickets are up for grabs right now. They're on sale today, but the ticket sales will close on August the 28th, 2021. 
and the winner will be randomly chosen the day after that. All the details and links you need are in the video description, and I wish you the very best of luck. I'll catch you next time. Bye for now. Thank you.